Alright, hello everyone, oh. and welcome to a new War Thunder video. This time, we are flying in the Yanks, the Americans, of course. But, uh, you know what? Uh, I change my American aircraft, same with basically all the aircraft. I put the Royal Canadian Air Force Roundel on it, so it's Canadian now. So, uh, yeah, this Buffalo is Canadian. But anyways... So we are here on Desert Canyon or African Canyon. Here's the Kitty Hawk here. Let's light him up with my uh, four 50 caliber Browning machine guns. There we go. That Kitty Hawk's down. There's an HE-112. Put some shots on him as well. Shoot out some ground targets. It's always, uh, never hurts to take out some ground targets. It helps you, uh, win the battle. But, anyways, we are continuing to move on. Some plane here, I don't know what it is, is moving up on our six. War Thunder replay bug. Looks like a Spitfire. There we go. Took. It actually was a hurricane. Well, we took out a hurricane. And this looks to be some. Yeah, it looks like it was a Wildcat. Or a Hellcat. It was a. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was a Wildcat. Just taking a look at some armored cars here putting some shots on them as well. Here's an eye shock, even though it doesn't say I remember from the uh, when I played it. An eye shock was trying to land. It looks like one of uh, like his tail control was taken out. Uh, there we go. He's down. Gotta get out of here though because of, because of the thick anti-aircraft fire coming from the base. So far, that's three kills. One on the Kitty Hawk, the Hurricane, and the Ishak. Doing some dodge in here. And now we're clear from the AA fire, it looks like. Now I'm gonna start strafing, side strafing these uh, armored cars. Ooh, almost hit ground, the ground there, but uh, I pulled up in time, thankfully. Looks like that armored car just did a U-turn there. Some strunk driving. But anyways, guy here to our to my right. There's some people here going in for some strafing runs on these guys. Some shots on them. Yeah, that's right, boy. Oh, someone's on me. Get into the tactical donut weaving. Oh, shot down. What was that? A Russian? I think it was a MiG-3. That who killed me. But anywho, uh, we got four ground targets destroyed there. Now I'm in the uh, not so good P-36A Hawk. As you can see there, there is a. Uh, First Nations Chief on the side. But yeah. Once again, Air Force, uh, the Canadian Air Force Roundel. I-15. Tried to get some shots, uh, but I uh, was coming in at uh, too much of an angle. So, all of them missed. Going around this mountain, I got hit once by something, so that's why I'm doing these tight turns. Get some cinematic shots here. Yeah. My aircraft has been destroyed. Basically destroyed though. Trying to take out this Catalina here. 
a big fat bomber. Always easy to take out. But it certainly, uh, don't try ramming the Catalina. Because you will die and he will live. I saw that that, uh, M or that uh, Italian aircraft there was getting a bit too close to me, so I pulled off to the side a bit. Just, uh, unloading the shells on him here. I'm, I'm reloading. I'm gonna have to reload here soon. Yeah, I only have my 7.7 millimeter guns there. Getting some maneuvers. Uh, fortunately, I was ooh-killed, but that Catalina is going down as well. So, nothing really there. Uh, just some shots on the Catalina. I'll just wait for the next aircraft. We are in my first Buffalo, the F-2A, I think. Uh, yeah, the F-2A1. The big buffalo, the gray one, that you first saw was a F-2A3 or something. Or F-2A3. F-2A3. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. But anywho, putting some shots on this guy here. Once again, War Thunder replays. I can't actually see what I'm shooting at. Bam, picked up another kill there. Looks like a uh, uh, German aircraft there. The Germans. But anyways, four kills. Quite a good amount of XP or score. Just absolutely destroyed this guy. Uh, four ground targets for air kills two deaths but there we go that goes down but this thing is certainly uh, a tough aircraft you you can have like just be under fire from a lot of stuff and it will still fly the armament it's pretty decent for a tier one or a level one whatever it's called in war thunder it, oh, BF-110 on me. But it has one 7.7mm 30 caliber and one 50 caliber 12.7mm gun. Got the German biplane there on him. Yeah, couldn't get some payback on this BF-110 for trying to shoot at me with his 20 mils. Almost crashed into my friendly... Uh, there. There we go, BF-110 is down. Put some, uh, uh, returning, uh, shots while he's going down for insult to injury. But, uh, just gonna fly around here, stay close to the airbase. Uh, right now I've taken no damage. Um, yeah, just gonna fly around for a little bit. speed it up so don't have to wait for ages to actually get back into the uh, fighting I was testing out some of the G forces there uh, you saw my pl uh, me going into some dives and some turns and stuff but anyways there's the fury there's a falco over there Alright, the strafing run begins again. If first you don't succeed, try again. So that's what I'm doing here. I'm not sure if that's how the quote goes, but... It's, uh, if it's not, then I just created a new one. So, copyright 2015 donut sandwich. No one's allowed to use that quote that I just made. If no, If, if no one has used that quote before, it's mine. Alright. There's some strong armored cars just getting shot at and they still survive. <laughs> um not 
not sure what that is. Back there. I think it was some aircraft wreckage. I think uh, the HE-51 uh, got uh, you killed back there. Anyways, picked up another armored car kill. Hmm, just doing some maneuvers. Oh, oh, oh. yes. Very well. Look at this beauty. Oh, got some cliff shots here. But, you know, some people uh, don't really like playing War Thunder. Uh, but you certainly can't deny how pretty this game is. This game just, it's, it's graphics are so crisp. I mean, you know, they uh, destroy some, some of the games today for graphics. And the thing is, is that this game isn't, you know, like Call of Duty, where it has because Call of Duty Advanced Warfare has some pretty good graphics, but that's only, uh, like the maps are only a couple hundred, like a hundred meters by a hundred meters, so it doesn't really have to render that much, and it looks good. Going into a head-on pass with this gladiator. Got him, though. Ha, got him. Uh, but we took damage there. The Enion is, uh, getting, uh, a bit slow slowing down strafing this ack ack gun but uh ooh yes please falco landing too oh very honorable but to anywho going in for a second strafing run on this falco there we go we got him but unfortunately that damage that the uh, gladiator has done to me will uh, finally kick in. The Enion has been knocked out. Now I don't know if you were paying attention to the scores, but we were losing. Then we came back and won. There we go. The game has ended. And yeah, that was my terror run on the enemies in my American slash Canadian aircraft. As you can see here, seven kills, four ground. Uh, or, no. I don't know. Uh, four assists, seven kills. I think I got like six uh, ground destroys. Uh, two deaths. So yeah, that was me flying in the Yankees. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Very well. Like and favorite this stuff. And I'll see you next time.